Norway wants to get out of bad deal with EU Brussels hit by huge new blow ahead of vote Norway is seemingly keen on loosening relations with Brussels as a Eurosceptic party tops the polls in the upcoming 2021 elections. The Centre Party, who are currently leading in opinion polls wants a looser deal with Brussels. It comes as the ruling Conservative Party threatened to block EU vessels from Norwegian waters if a UK Brexit trade deal wasn't secured. The Nordic nation is not part of the EU but is part of the European single market meaning it is forced to follow certain Brussels policies through the European Economic Area Agreement which it has no say over as a non-member. But the deal allows Oslo to retain more control over key parts of its economy particularly its fishing grounds. It previously negotiated annually with the bloc about the management of common fish stocks, access to each other's waters and exchange of fish quotas until the UK left the EU. Now Oslo wants a trilateral deal in place between the UK and EU but these negotiations have not yet started because of the ongoing scramble between London and Brussels. Norway's fisheries minister Roger Ingebrigtsen said, if we do not get a deal by January 1st, we will not open Norway's economic fishing zones to vessels from the EU and Britain. But the centre party, led by Trygve Slagsvold Vedum, said alternatives needed to be looked at hinting at a cutting of the cord with the EU. The Centre Party is also pushing hard to cut the amount Norway pays in grants to Brussels from the €2.7 billion Euros it paid in 2014 to 2021. Sigbjorn Gelsvik, the party's spokesperson on EU relations, said, The deal we have now is a bad one. We need to discuss the alternatives. The Norwegian MP said the party wanted something closer to a traditional trade deal like Canada has. In opinion polls undertaken by Kantar, Centre registered 22.1% support whilst the ruling Conservatives led by Prime Minister Erna Solberg were backed by 20.2% of voters surveyed. It was the first time the Centre Party had led such a survey since Kantar began measuring voter habits in 1964. Another poll undertaken by Centio Research Norway has revealed 49% of Centre voters would answer yes, while only 39% would answer no in a referendum on the existing EEA agreement. Torgir Nag Filkane, Centre Party leader, added, We will look at the election result and take it from there. We are convinced that there are better ways to organise trade and cooperation with the EU, without having to lose the country for power over our own societal development. The Centre Party was founded almost 100 years ago and backed successful campaigns rejecting EU membership at referenda in 1972 and 1994. In response, a spokesperson for Norway's Prime Minister Erna Solberg, said, the Centre Party wants to rip the foundation from under our market access.